Mind if I stay at your place? The dreaded ask that has you coming here for some support. Whether it's from your family, your out-of-town friends, or some random acquaintance you haven't heard from in years, this question has you stressed and uncomfortable because you don't know how to say no. Saying no is a learned skill and one that must be practiced to be part of your language. But how do you tell someone you don't want them to stay at your house without hurting their feelings? Oh, don't suffer in silence, my friend. Let's look at all the ways we can be warm yet still unwelcoming to unwanted guests. Set expectations. Tell them up front that they cannot stay with you. Yes, this is easier said than done. You may be tempted to hedge the truth or outright lie about why you cannot host them, but we encourage you to be honest. Once you start spinning that web of lies, you're bound to get yourself caught at some point. Muster up the courage to stand up for yourself and your personal boundaries. Be honest, but kind. In telling them that you cannot host them at your house, keep it gentle and kind. This is especially important for close family members and loved ones. You don't need to blow up your relationship over a spare bedroom. If the request is coming from someone a bit more distant, a simple and respectful decline will do the trick. For example, oh, great uncle Horace, my home isn't available for you to stay, but we can always catch up for coffee when you're in town. Give your reasons, but not your excuses. Let's say you've been given advance notice of a guest request and it falls on the same dates that you have other plans. Then lead with this, but be wary. If you're using it as an excuse, then they may come back and say, oh, no worries, our dates are flexible. See you in two weeks. Offer alternatives. Suggest a few Airbnbs, a nice budget motel that's nearby, or a familiar chain that has a great breakfast buffet. You don't have to do this, but this small gesture of goodwill could go a long way. Your home is your safe haven. But with protecting your privacy, it is also important to remain respectful and considerate of your relationship with your friends and family. Learning to say no to unwanted house guests is a life lesson you need to lean into. And we hope we've helped you get the confidence to speak your truth. Good luck.